This is part 4 of chat GPT series. In this video, we are going to talk about the training data used to develop chat GPT, one of the most advanced language models currently available. Chat GPT is a pre-trained model, which means that it was trained on a massive amount of data before it was released to the public. The training data used to develop chat GPT is a diverse set of text from the internet, including books, articles, and websites. The training data is used to teach the model the patterns and relationships that exist in human language. The more diverse and representative the training data is, the better the model can learn to generate text that mimics human language. One of the key advantages of using a pre-trained model like ChatGPT is that it allows users to fine-tune the model on specific tasks or datasets without having to train the model from scratch. This means that users can take advantage of the model's pre-existing knowledge of language patterns to quickly train a model that is well suited to their specific task. It's worth noting that ChatGPT like other pre-trained models, also inherits some biases present in the data it was trained on. It's important to be aware of these biases and use appropriate techniques to mitigate them when using the model for specific tasks. In summary, the training data used to develop ChatGPT is a diverse set of text from the internet, which is used to teach the model the patterns and relationships that exist in human language. This allows the model to generate text that mimics human language, and also allows users to fine-tune the model on specific tasks or datasets. That's a brief on the training data used to develop ChatGPT, we hope you found it informative. Thanks for watching. Part 5 continues.